Do y'all check the jail roster in the morning time? Better yet, do you have a southern mama, a nosy southern mama? Because, honey, I do. I ain't set my alarm clock in years. It's 7 o'clock every morning. I know she's going to give me the foolishness. It ain't really foolishness. I mean, she's going to give me the business. She's like Channel 5 News, dedicated, determined, dependable. She starts out with the jail roster. If I know the people, which normally I do, because in my county, people like to make things, okay? Create things. And uh, lots of times, it's people I went to school with. And she sends me the screenshots and their photos. Yeah, my mama don't work. She doesn't have a normal job. But um, on social media, she has a job. She's a social worker on social media. I got the jail. I got the jail roster. And then she sent me a song. Ooh, that smell. Can you? Yeah, she sent me that. Sent me um, newspaper articles of the number of toys they found in Diddy's house and all the Johnson & Johnson stuff. And she said, whoo, I know his house was stinking. And she sent me that song. Now, there can be advantages to having a nosy Southern mama. For example, you need to know something. You want to know something. You're curious about something, but you ain't got time to go in the rabbit hole and look it up. You, I, just just send her the text. Say, hey, what you know about this? She's going to find the mama, daddy, uncle, brother, cousin, stepdaddy, cousin. She's going to tell you when they adopted that dog in 1986. She's going to tell you what house they bought in 2002, when they sold it, how much they made for a profit, what their taxes were, who they bought it from, who they married, and where they're at now. She's also going to tell you the square footage of their house, okay? She's going to tell you how many acres they live on, and she's going to tell you what cars are in the driveway on that Carroll County Tax Commissioner's page within 24 hours. So it's like having your own personal private investigator. If you follow me on the Book of Faces, you know those people on the Book of Faces, they're a whole nother, something ain't right with them, okay? They're, they're just a bunch of angry folks on there. If you ever see Sherry Vickers stamps in the comments, that's my mama, okay? Some of y'all have became friends with her. Do not have your job or your significant other or family member List it in your bio if you're going to talk junk to me. Because my mama is going to tell it. And she's going to screenshot it. I had a lady message me the other day. She was like, I am so sorry about my husband's comments. Do you know my mama had done screenshotted them things he was saying to me on air one of my videos and sent it to his darn wife. I'm not responsible for my mama's behaviors if you talk to me crazy on the book of faces. According to my grandmother, my mama knows more than Jesus Christ. Which is real funny because my mama acts just like my grandmother, right? Even though she bosses me, don't you come in the comments with no unsolicited advice. Because she's going to give it to you. So if you have one of them nosy southern mamas, I do too. We just got to appreciate them. They mean well, I think, most of the time. You know what subject my mama's studying today? Uh, Alec Baldwin. Yeah, his niece married Justin Bieber. And um, according to her... Alec was at the top of Epstein's, Epstein's list or something. And then Justin Bieber was up under Diddy's wing. I, she's going in a rabbit hole today. I, I'll give you the full report later tonight when, we, when she figures it out. If you need any investigative reporting done, let me know.